lot of people want to. A lot of people want to say, um, "Wow, such like overnight success to be so young and to be 18." But really, it's almost like since I was in diapers, I've wanted it. So, um, or I've I've recognized singing as a true love. So, um, but it's been like practically 18 years in the making. So of this overnight success. But um, what did you want? Like a history? There were no um, CDs that I cut. I mean, my, my you know, uh, my debut record, having been Genie in a Bottle and whatever, was my very first release of me. But before then, it, I was on the Milan soundtrack. I had a song, Reflection, which was the pop ballad from that soundtrack. And, um, you know, I was, I'd done two seasons on the Mickey Mouse Club when I was 12 and 13. Before that, like, my first national television debut was Star Search, which I had totally lost. <laughs> I was a Star Search loser when I was eight years old. And, um, you know, just... Things like that, and certain auditions along the way. I did some international work when I was 16, going to Romania, representing the U.S. in an international talent competition. I had a duet released uh, in the same year at that age um, in Japan with a, a Japanese singer. So things like that until what's led up to now. But this is what I've always wanted to do, is to be a recording artist. And to be successful is another story. So <laughs> hopefully continuing that success. Yeah, we were tutored on the set, so we had, um, it was crazy, we had, uh, you know, tutors on the set, we ranged from ages like 11 years old, Brittany was the youngest, to, um, to uh, like 20, so it was crazy. And after the season was over, did you go back to regular high school? Yes, How yes. It, it was a bit difficult. Um, academically, I guess it was, you know, you got right back into the groove of things, but it's just, it was weird about the peers, you know what I mean? I mean, the peers would, they didn't really know how to react to seeing, you know, your, your classmate or your peer, like, on TV one minute and then going to, like, you know, home economics class with them the next minute. You know what I mean? It was just kind of odd, and it put me in a tough situation, and it was difficult at times, but it worked out. Last question? What's next? What's next? Well, I just um, got done. The video for my next single will be released, uh, the next single being What a Girl Wants, which is um, taking it to the next level. It's a little bit more, it, sh it showcases what I want to do vocally more than Genie in a Bottle did. Um, it's a little more urban uh, in that direction. And uh, um, it's, uh, it's, it's really cool. I have a Christmas single out, Chestnuts Roasting on an Open Fire. We have a whole ballad of that. And um, also a dance remix, Thunderpuss 2000 remix. And uh, in the new year, I'm, I'll be going on tour with TLC and Destiny's Child and um, releasing a Spanish album as well from my Latina side. Okay, thank you.